everybody, it's Sarah from Cuddle With This Book, and I am doing in my mailbox for today, Sunday, January 29th, 2012. It's almost February. Wow. Um, in my mailbox is hosted by Kirstie at the Story Siren, and I'm a little bit goofy tonight. I don't know if it's my Broadway obsession right now because I'm having one, or if I just didn't sleep enough last night, or I, I'm not sure. But anyway, first I want—I have something special, I guess, but uh, I want to say what books I got this week. They're all from the library, and they, I think there's only one that's not a debut uh, for 2012. So, first book out of the bag. Yeah. Alicia Whitaker, Queen of Kentucky. And this sounds adorable. And, you know, I always love adorable books, so I'm excited for that. Actually, uh, Everything You Need to Survive the Apocalypse, I'm reading that right now, and it's adorable. So, yeah, I'm not done yet, but I will be probably maybe maybe by the end of the week if I'm lucky. Um, okay, so I got ooh, Fracture by Megan Miranda. And the cover's so pretty, and my little sticker from the library is still on it, but, um, uh, it sounds really interesting. I know she dies. She's under the water for 11 minutes, and her heart stops, and she dies. But, she comes back. So, that's where it sounds interesting. Yeah, I'm excited to read that a lot. I got Tempest by Julie Cross and I have heard some good things and bad things about this so far but I'm looking forward to reading it um today Jackson and Holly are in love it just sounds great uh, one of my characters though is named Jackson in my my story and he is not so nice <laughs> so <laughs> maybe you'll get to see that someday um, I got Getting Somewhere by Beth Neff, which is an awesome name. It rhymes, kind of. So, yeah. It's a really pretty um, cover. It's about these, uh, I guess, delinquents who, um, they have the choice to go to prison or to work on a farm as an experiment. So, it sounds really interesting. And my friend pointed out how pretty the cover is, and it doesn't look so photoshopped. It looks like hand-drawn and really, really good, so, um, yeah, I'm excited for this one, too, and I love the pages, they're not the same length, or width, whatever you want to call it, but yeah, I really like it. Um, oh, that's a CD, that doesn't count. <laughs> okay, let's see, Cracked. by K.M. Bolton, and I know, I don't know much besides it's about uh, rehab and addiction, which I am all over. I love that stuff. I love psychology. I love, you know, so I, I don't think I like rehab, but I like books about it, I guess. Uh, so I also got Still Waters. And this is by Emma Carlson Bernie, Bernay. And it's about this girl who goes to the cabin with her boyfriend. And, um, and it, I think it's supposed to be kind of scary. I've read interviews and, like, things about it, but I can't really remember any of it. But uh, it's not very long, and I really want to read it. It sounds so good. So feel like I'm missing one. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. That's all. That's all the books. I found the other one. Um, so, those are all the books for the week. But this past weekend, I never get to do this because I never get to see these things. I um, went to see a Broadway play. Not in Broadway, but in Pittsburgh where I live. Um, with school, we went for free. And I saw... Spring Awakening, which is a new musical, and it's amazing, and I just 
wanted to tell you guys all that it's an incredible show and if you ever get to see it if you're old enough to see it because it is a little bit I don't know I told my mom about it and she said it sounded corrupt and evil but it's not um it's it says at the bottom contains strong language and explicit sexual content and it's an on stage um, performance but it's so amazing the soundtrack has been looping through my head all day I was listening to it and I was listening to Rent I love Rent um, I love Wicked Rent's my favorite all time favorite but uh, Spring Awakening is really good my one friend and I are going to go see it next Saturday so I'm going to see it again she didn't get to see it on Friday when we went so we're going to go see it before it closes um, we're both excited about that. We're both listening to the soundtrack like nonstop. So, yay! It's exciting. Um, so that's all there is for this week, really. So, have a good week, and I hope you got some great stuff. Let me know in the comments, and I'll see you in February. Wow! See you guys.